How na day, my people? Una welcome to the Fina Show today. Asuna Sabi, my name, Naibi Fina Brooks. Today, my people, today, I get the delicious, fantastic, super producer. In fact, music producer, the one, the only, Mastercraft in the house. <laughs> welcome to the Fina Show. Thank you so much. I appreciate mm -hmm. it. Appreciate. Mm -hmm. We didn't live for Nigel. Make we young small. Okay, to now. Talky. Yes, yes. To when it comes to music, why music for you? Why have you seen a music you choose to do? Mm. Um, I know things that me choose to do music. I think, see, I just did lucky, say music choose me. Because I remember growing up, there was too many things I wanted to be. Mm. I normally, when I was in school, I wanted to be an accountant or a doctor, one of those. You know, extra yeah, things. academic stuff. Academic things, you know. <laughs> Time goes on now because now I just let them bomb me. Oh. I can't begin to see, say, okay, maybe this scientist, all these things not going to work. Mm -hmm. Look at fish with an IDC. Right. So I started going for training. I wanted to become a professional boxer, you know, until when Eshin, our coach, blew somebody's nose, his nose burst. Oh, yeah? Now I take off. I know Greece joined that one again. I wow. practically joined almost everything that was, that was, you know, that had to do with force. Mm. Boxing, wrestling, army, boy scouts. Army? I tried to join army, yes. Nigerian army? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right? I practically attempted all of that. Then, you know, I just leave them to fit. And one lucky day, I think there's this guy that usually will come to our house with the piano because my senior brother, they play. Up until that faithful day, I come to say, you know what? This boy will just come here every day. We, we can't even know what's in the day. I come to him and say, oh boy, show me what's in the day. press for this thing. Really. <laughs> On the keyboard? On the keyboard, yeah. Wow. That was how, you know, the, the guy put me on. He taught me how to play the major scales and then taught me how to play a song, a church song. Oh, Lord, my God, how excellent is your name? And then all from that, I just automatically knew how to, because there's something called progression in, right. in music. Right. That's one thing that nobody can teach you. Mm. If you have it in you, you have it in you. It's like clapping your hands. Right. Nobody can teach you how to clap your hand to a beat. Right. If you don't have it in you, you don't have it then in you. Then you will never have it in you. Never. <laughs> if you if you have it in you, then somebody can teach you how to variate it, how to right. you know, change it to different type of class. But mm. if you don't have it, you don't have it. Mm. You know, so then that progression thing, just with those three chord progressions. I just knew how to, you know, play to every other song. And that's how music started for me. You know. Wow. When are we gonna stop singing about Africa? Personally, you're one of you're my favorite producer. Because okay. I know you're talented. You're not, I've seen you at work and you're naturally talented. If not be saying a music now you do or you day into what's your second possible second profession way for joining? Off of the top of my head, I'm not sure if you think of anything past music right now because music don't actually practically give me almost everything what I get. Mm. Then give me clue of waiting I feel get even around music. Right. You know, I used to always say that if with all of the sense what they make music, if I'm not trying to do music, I'd definitely be one of the world's renowned criminals. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. That's because a good I one. I don't know any other thing where the kind of intellect where I get if you do again pass to to a day of you know advantage of or maybe you're taking advantage of people in some type of way. So mm. I don't know. I don't really figure out. Mm. Okay. Because I think it, well, with the gift when you get in music, I think say music comes to you naturally, mm -hmm. and you fit. You fit. I'm sure you did dream of music. You go to sleep. You just <laughs> dream of beats. Yes, just yeah. like that. If any Pekin young man, young woman, they out there when you say, I would like to do what Mastercraft is doing, mm -hmm. which advice you go give them? Um, I think the, the one advice we no go ever changes. It's two things. One is faith. Secondly, is patience. It's one of the things that I've carried all my life. Mm. You know, because sometimes you, you feel like you are you're meant to do some stuff. Mm. But at the end of the day, even while before you get to see the limelight, even when you don't see the limelight and you need to push on, sometimes one of the things we go your experience is feel no match within you really won't become mm. at the time. So that's why you need faith. That's true. You know, and then patience too. Like, I, like, one of the things I always say, you know, one of the things that amazed me growing up is the fact that we started making music, I started making music from the house, mm. you know, from a headphone I bought in Computer Village mm. for 1,200 naira. Wow. You know, <laughs> using that headphone they put from my ear, they make song. 
it got to a point that even when I started traveling out, I would get to big studios where there's like big mixers and all of that. <laughs> you still prefer that your cheap one. I would sit and use my your head own head <laughs> You know? And at the end of the day, that just gives me, that's just it, just, it just depicts the fact that you can change the world from anywhere. That's true. So that's thinking true. about literally, we, we will sit down inside heat. Mm. We sweat, mm. no light. We remove our shirts. We only our nika. They try to make one beat. Right. Wear headphones. The song will go hit. Right. You know, we gonna come out with the philosophy. And inside hits, they make hits. Then they make a bio. You know, what I'm abio. <laughs> we just balance our life. So it's like it's, it's you can do anything you want to do. You can change the world from your bedroom. As That's right. As long as you are consistent, you have faith, and you are patient, that whatever you believe with the faith is going to come to pass. That's right. That's, That's right. That's right, you, you did correct very well. If there's anywhere in this world where you can be, where you could make you happy, maybe that place. <laughs> there's too many places I would love to be in this world. Definitely, Canada is my one of my first choices because I feel like, especially during winter, Canada is chill. So right. that's an opportunity for me to be indoors, right. create my own fireplace, mm -hmm. set two small speakers, just the knock off bed, do the recording. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, it will give me a different vibe. Mm -hmm. America too getting your own energy because you know, America and our country when they sleep. Right. 24-7, <laughs> something they happen. Right. You know, I'd love that type of energy. But again, Nigeria has something that is just special. Even though it never come to its complete form yet. Right. We hope God God willing that with the help of uh, the next election, mm. you know, we feel if we be obedient and willing, ah, we better be we, obedient. We, yeah, we better be obedient. I think that's I'll the beg only you. possible chance. <laughs> yes, I so. can see from a layman standpoint, except mm. if there's any other political undertone where I don't know about. No, we never, there's nothing. That's the only choice. Right. The only choice when Niger gets right now, now obedient. Thank you very much. I'm that's sorry. You. Trust, there's trust no me. second choice or third choice or any <laughs> other option. I think of Yeah. So, so make we just the obedient. Just, just hoping that things get better. Other than that. I think whatever makes you know makes pure gold is fire. Mm. That's one of the only That's advantages true. of Nigeria. It kind of puts you on your heel. It kind of pushes you, you know, to bring out the best in mm. you with some form of stress mm. and so far. We I know if you say we need because we can as well achieve that good without having to suffer this. Right. This is, this is and a double suffer be that like, if you don't work. <laughs> eventually, you know, but. That's just now. What we come meet, so mm. we we'll go just the face and go like that. So I literally we want to be in some other part of the world, but again, it, there's no place like home because this no is home for me. Like home. Eventually, yes. yes. Charity does begin at home. When are we gonna stop singing about Africa? Today we did live with the master craft himself. <laughs> if there is any advice you will give the next Nigerian president, which advice you will give them? My advice to the next president is it could definitely be kind of brutal. Um, like I will always say, if you allow me to become the governor of Lagos State, mm. I think the first thing, first major thing I'll do is from Lekki Phase 1 gate mm. up to the refinery where I hear say this man debuted. Mm. Uh, Dangote. Dangote debuted. Inside, mm. inside that job, I convert everywhere first to prison. <laughs> <laughs> really? I convert as a prison because everybody needs to enter prison. <laughs> and the prison no go be anything too tedious. Mm. It's just an avenue for you to work and make money for the government mm. as much as possible, at least labor. Then right. secondly, also the prison could get some form of correctional time, mm. like between six to like eight. Mm. You could go class. They could teach you. That's no one year old. How to behave. They could teach you how to behave if you see traffic lights. Right. Teach you how to behave if you see another woman being waiting in distress. That's right. Teach you how to behave. Then give you electoral position or government position. Just all of those things. Just you will school them. Mm. Then if you enter there and at two weeks you serve, you can go as I go commit the same crime. Hmm. They go increase that two weeks to two months. Right. Just first and foremost, because I feel like the challenge with Nigeria as a country is individual. It's not necessarily... It's not the country. government. No. It's the people. No, the government is involved. The government yeah, but too, again, but the, the now people, people, they make government. The government. Right. Yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. So I feel like it's the people. So mm -hmm. if I become the president of Nigeria, the first thing I think I'm going to institute is first and foremost, the enforcement of law. Mm. Yeah. Because, because there's no enforcement of law, 
nobody knows what is right and what is wrong. The people mm. will be big men, we go do the wrong thing, can easily get away. Right. The poor man we know we, 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 we suffer for waiting, you know, no. That's number one. And I think if there's anything I will first and foremost influence or implement is the fact that, you know, we have to find a way to balance the cost of things. Which means there has to be a body that so that 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 checks to make sure that everything is equal, mm. no matter the location. Mm. For example, in my few times I visited Canada and America, there is something called Walmart. Mm. There's Walls Green. Right. There's various places like that. Right. If I go to Walls Green in 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 in, in, in the in, US, in, in let's say if, let me take Canada for example in okay. Toronto, mm. and I go I enter Walls Green for Toronto, I say I want to buy something. Mm. The price is not different from the Walls Green in Calgary. No, it's the same. Ordinary island to mainland. Mm. The price of something for mainland different from island. The inside island mm. then gets small prices and high prices for the same quality of right. Things. So this in itself now transfers discrimination now, on top of that. Transfer it now to the health sector. If you mm. understand what I mean. Mm. So oh yeah, that's there dangerous. There is no balance for mm. people, of for humans. It's like mm. some people be believe that they deserve this. Mm. Some people are here. Right. Why can't we have a way to balance these things for let everybody the price be equal for everybody? Mm. That in itself kind of breaks the bridge between who be rich man and who be, and who poor, be poor man. man. Right. So that in itself will reduce the pressure of people having to, you know, feel like they want to kill themselves because they don't have access to those things. That's true. So I feel like that's one thing that mm. we need to implement. Okay. And also, if there's also a way that they can, they can, the federal government can reduce the bulk of work or pressure that it has and make the state government concentrate right. on fixing the state. Because that is not easy. Because from the state's governor, it's probably maybe the different constituencies and the local government chairman. Mm -hmm. So they can easily find a way to make things work right. individually as a state. Right. But again, make a no, no talk, long talk, no good for every service for Nigeria. <laughs> <my target. laughs> but the one thing when I know say go solve a lot of problems, not to, you know, decentralize the police. Mm -hmm. Because police now, how can police be federal? Eventually, they don't get state police. Like in what the difference between here and abroad be? Every city get their own police. You police yourself, and you know your neighborhood. The police know their neighborhood. They live in the neighborhood. They are from the neighborhood. They grow up in the neighborhood. So they know what thing they happen for that neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not be the the orders does not come from the federal government or even from the province. That's the state. The order comes from the city. Mm -hmm. So Lagos police will be Lagos police, and within the Lagos, Lekki police will be Le the, even mm -hmm. their mm -hmm. emblem will say Lekki police. police. Every law, they look at, so people can relate. They not be waiting the, the federal government. They talk Justin Trudeau will say this is the law. No, no, no. They get federal laws and are the big laws: immigration, mm -hmm. uh, federal crimes, little. Local mm -hmm. crimes are meant for local police, not the federal police. Exactly. Right? So here now, now only one police. They get one IG if it come from Abuja. Exactly. So if there's a problem, you have to wait for Abuja to, to solve the problem. Yeah, it's, it's eh? Imagine. That's exactly just, why I said the federal government has to drop a lot of baggage. Lots. Allow the state yes. to take control of them. Yes. And let the federal take only what is necessary for, for federal. Yep. Now, if God say, my begin Sunday, I want to make you into an animal, not a human being. Mm -hmm. Which animal God will make you into? <laughs> so the animals get their good and bad sides. Right. So are humans too. Yeah, right. Like actually, though, mm -hmm. I would either go for the lion or the eagle for now. Eagle. Yeah. <laughs> Fly like an eagle. Eh? <laughs> and also be single. Now also be single. So that's all I can do now. All the other few do. So now, if God says, "Okay, I don't want to make you into an animal." But I want to make you into something that is not in that is in uh, animates. What you definitely water, 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 not get any me. And again, water, <laughs> you not get any At me. All, right. Get. If there is one person, or whether in a family or not family, or anybody in the world, when we say he don't die or he they alive, and you will want to ask them one question, who that person will be? My dad, because I loved him so much before he passed on. Mm -hmm. uh, nobody said a question I get for him, but I wish he just tell me one more last word. Right. Yeah, because 
I was there. So it's almost like Aww. I kept hitting him all through the night, just waiting for just make it just tell me say, okay, yes. now so it'll be, but we'll see you again. Right. Just something like that. If right. I just help me. Mm. But the fact that you know talk to me and he never still talk to me yes. till now. Yes, yes. You know, that that's one thing I that's if there was anything I wanted him to say, just boy, I don't move, oh, no worry, we'll go. you get us we'll go there now later on, mm-hmm. you know. Just that would have gone a long way for me. Yeah. My dad would always call me then and he would just talk. Yes. You know, but this time, this particular day, he just called me, told me what he wanted to tell me. I told him, don't worry, I'll fix it. Mm-hmm. Then he started praying for me. Aww. And when, while he was praying for me, usually I would just touch him and say, Papa, hey, man, hey, man, yeah, Papa, I don't want to let him For some words in my mind, tell me, say, no rush let, this let man. Let him pray for you. Talk. Yes. Pray, finish, pray, finish, pray, finish, pray, finish. Come tell me one more thing, see. Oh boy, make sure say for this life, you know, cheat another man right. Right, of your right and not take another man's wife. Mm. These two things, yes. you know, once you do these two things, you go be successful and you go live long. Right. And what, that's the last thing he said. Yeah. So me, just look and say, okay, I mean, this man, they see me, they do something bad. You have been something bad. Or maybe something there for my front, what right. can happen to me where I never. So, because I don't know the person they died until that's my dad true. died. Yes, that's true, right? You never really experienced no, 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 someone no, no, no. close I to you. I just they go wake up and wake up, yeah. rise, yeah. run around. They don't know say na issue. Yes. You know, up until the fact that it now dawned on me that that was the last time we actually spoke on the Wow. Who will be your favorite person in the world? My favorite person in the world right now is my daughter, Aww. Amarachi Estamike. You know, because the, the, it's it's... I didn't even know what it meant to for a child to grow up. So mm. now waking up in the morning and being on the call with my daughter and seeing her evolve, yes. turn into things that it just amazes me to see her. That you did this. Yeah. This like, is you. Yeah, it's like <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing. It is amazing. Yeah. It is amazing. Amarachi, your daddy's little angel and his <laughs> favorite person in the world. So that's beautiful. That's beautiful. We gonna stop singing about Africa if you can transport yourself anywhere in the world right now where it go be I go go meet Amarachi for oh that's so beautiful <laughs> that's, that's so beautiful crazy. okay now because people you know many people know you they mm-hmm. know you but they don't know some intricacies about you mm-hmm. so make we find out what would be your favorite food I don't do many many research can't realize it. I like swallow and okay. this swallow now, my favorite soup is definitely obono soup, but with bitter leaf, not the regular obono. Right. That bitter leaf, and they give me the vibe. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. I don't be too much of a meat person, but I know like say I chuck my inside soup, make something not come out. Mm. So no be like say heavy meat, but you know, make for more shaky. Just sometimes it's very just the available. You say right. anytime I dip my inside the dry soup, right. man no go come out alone. Right. Yeah, that kind of thing. That's right. it. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. So if I say make you describe yourself in one sentence, who is Sunday, also known as Mastercraft? How you would describe the man behind that title? Mm. I, I think if there's anything I've always said since I was a little kid is that I'm a believer. Mm. Even if you check my status on Instagram, we status will still change, but that's right. like my base. I'm a believer. I call myself a believer all the time. Not because I, I try or because I too try or I yes. don't try. Yes. Everything I have was given to me. So I'm not scared to lose it. I mm-hmm. believe that whoever, the person will give me, will give me again. Yes. And if he give you, you know they take him back from you. Yes. Sir. When humans <laughs> give you, then they take back. Definitely. But God, yeah. you know they take back. Exactly. How does music make you feel? Mm. In the words of uh, Bob Marley, he says, when, when music hits you, you will feel no pain. Aww. You know, so I feel like anything that you hear that suits your soul, makes you feel good, and it's sound, that's music right there. Music may not be the, the two way they're available, mm. but now how the person be able to interpret them and they communicate to that person when you them. Right. That's what it is. What do you think that people they get wrong about you, if you want to correct it? I personally don't think so, I think about anything like that, because again, I'm of the opinion that nobody can really understand anybody that is a creative person or a person in position. Mm. The people that are watching you attain greatness will not understand you. 
So that's true, actually. <laughs> People that are artistic, they think differently. Seeing a lot of musical, our own musical journey, mm. many years ago, we put out songs. You go to the blog, you see people writing. This right. song is trash. This one is that. That. Blah, that's blah. what they were saying. You get those type of comments first day. Wow. In three months' time, the song is the number same one people. song in the club. The and they say, oh, come back. Say, oh, this is the best song this ever. Song is my, <laughs> this song is mad. You know, so it's almost like it's always a tool of motivation yeah. to create more when people don't even understand you. That's right. Like it drives you better to your direction because it gives you space to see the people that you, the enemies that you need to conquer. Right. Yeah. Today, we did chat with the man behind the title. <laughs> Mastercraft. So when are they hear all this music? When did they create? <laughs> eh? When did they create? They give them. Um, when you go, they, you go to hear the, 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 the just the words. This is Mastercraft. That's my. <laughs> oh my God, I love that. And when are they hear them? Um, and the person did so. Oh, she. Because sometimes we go see the artists, the other artists <laughs> in there that they create and they make the beats. She. And he's a musician actually because Definitely. you don't you don't bring out some. Yeah, yeah. So you are a well-rounded artistic musician. Producer mm -hmm. and waiting else because there's songwriter. Some writer, there DJ, you go. The ah, band director. I tell you now. Mm -hmm. Plenty. I tell you now. now. <laughs> this man is full of talent. So we thank you very much yeah. for coming on the show and mm -hmm. for being who you are. Thank you so much. I appreciate mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. And I also wanted to add that you know, we, I just also want to say thank you to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for being who you are in all sincerity. Thank you. you know I mean, because sometimes, you know, there's you get some people who say they don't deny that. Maybe they can't leave Nigeria, they some other places, all of a sudden, then we just change how they relate with the mm. real things, you know, because the truth is that it takes a real person to recognize a real person. So I just, I'm using this as an opportunity to say thank you to you, okay. you know, for being that person who arms is always wide open. Oh, you know, thank you. You're making me blush. No, you, know, <laughs> you know, to uplift, maybe just me, but mm. I'm sure if many people when they watch this interview, you know, we get direct access to you, they will feel like I'm speaking their minds right now because oh. you're that one person who doesn't reject people. We know they take you know they take people for granted no matter how you meet them. Mm -mm. You know, that's that's hard right there because sometimes the best of people go through the, the, the worst of heartbreaks because the person oh, who yeah. they believe in no even knows that they try to carry them. you see one even do shakara join, but you know, mm -hmm. you've been able to stand through all of that for test of time. Helped a lot of people to cross over, turn them to human beings, made them now they're able to feed their families and even, you know, open the door for other people. I just personally want to say thank you to you and may God bless you. You're kidding people. me with this love. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much, Master. Me Kurt. and all of the many people, we love you oh, from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you. Thank Please you. Please so don't, don't even think about quitting. Don't even think about oh, quitting. Oh, if you know it's in the Definitely. blood. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so grateful for your help thank you. and thank for being my brother. Yeah, and my is. friend. You understand? Yes, yes. Appreciate that. Appreciate yes. that. Yes, thank you so much. All right. Is there anything else you want to say at all? Um, to anything, any subject, anything at all? I think maybe one more thing because I know that this okay. interview is going to outlive me. Outlive okay, good. Us, yes. Online, but yes. I think it still buttresses down to the first thing I said about faith and patience. Mm -hmm. you, know, you know, passing this message to a lot of men out there and young people, you know, who feel like life is going to end next year because they haven't achieved their own you know from the country where i'm from you see a lot of young people trying to go into rituals mm. people are getting into depression every day you know because mm. of the fact that they're putting their, themselves on on a lot of under a lot of pressure to look like what the society wants them to look like to drive a bench to build a house i just want you to hold on step back think about it if this is 2023 and you are just 20 years old there is still a lot of years ahead of you. Hmm. There is no need for pressure. Things are definitely going to change. All you need is faith and patience. Hmm. Just know that for whatever it will take, God will not let you go like that. You know, go waste. Right. I used to tell myself every, every time that all this effort what they put, you know, go, go in vain. Amen. You Amen. Know? And that's how it's going to be because you believe in that. Then I even have a philosophy up until the point that sometimes I tell myself that, even if the things where I sow, I know reap all of them for my time. You know, we still go in vain because we get, that's why we have generational wealth. We right. Have, it takes, some things go transfer to other places. So don't be selfish to just think mm. about yourself alone. Mm. Think about it on the long run. But know that no matter what happens, you can never lose because you're on the best side. 
You know mm. what I mean? Let that encourage you. Also, men should learn to speak up, especially in this time. I never did too old like that, but unfortunately, I've seen so many things happen in this mm. my lifetime where, especially now, mm. you see a lot of men dying of stroke, depression, wow. hypertension, because they cannot handle certain issue or they are not open enough to express mm. whatever they are going through to another person mm. for the person to help them out. Suicide is never an option. Mm. In fact, it's, to me, I, I think, I don't know whatever you are going through, but I think if you can just think about one or two people who love you, you should hold on on that decision. Right. There's always an opportunity, you know, to, to make it to the next day. So try and speak to someone, open up. Don't allow depression get into you because of pressure of the way the world is right now. Everything goes soft, my guy. Very Love. good words. Very good words of wisdom. Okay. Because life can change in it just like in mm. an instant. Yep. It can be better yep. than you thought. Yep. You know, so thank you for the advice. Appreciate that. I'm sure they'll appreciate it too. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you so much. Appreciate. They wave to the people. Bye bye, you. <laughs> <laughs>